Hey guys, uh, Bunny Builder here. Going to talk about ammo multipliers. So in all of the turrets, we got for Meta Glass, we got the damage, and we have the ammo multiplier. Uh, late game PvP super important for big waves. So if we take a look, Meta Glass, we have five ammo multiplier and three damage. What it means is for each piece of material, you're going to get five shots. So we can test that right now. We can put that in. Send Wraith out. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Uh, blast compound, we're gonna get four shots. For the cyclone, not enough to kill. Oh my god. Uh, plasmidium, more damage than the other two, has the lowest multiplier. So we're only gonna get two shots for this. That was enough. And then Surge Alloy. More damage. Um, this gets really important when you get big waves, big lines of turrets. So we can see if we were to use uh, this plasmidium, um, this would run out. Uh, this would all get used up right here uh, before it reached down the line, leaving an open space and killing your defense. Uh, what you want are buffers, so a good buffer is a bridge, I think it's called a bridge, yeah, bridge conveyor. Uh, these hold 10 items each, so you have a little bit of a buffer in between for it to catch up and to hold on to ammo. The other thing I do if you have a lot of resources is you can do a, it's not a vault, it's a container, you can do a container with two outputs. So this is one of my favorites, uh, notice that I have to put the junction right at the end. If I didn't have the junction, this output source, this unloader, uh, would be trying to fill the conveyor at the same time that it was trying to fill itself. So you gotta put the little junction in. Um, that's it, quick and simple. Uh, just keep in mind the ammo multiplier. Uh, you want to have, especially early game, you want stuff that has a high ammo multiplier. And that's it.